in emergency medicine. From there, I joined the EMT squad here on campus, and I've gotten a lot of great experience with my fellow students and supporting the campus community here. 102 over 60. In looking for uh, a summer experience, I came across internships offered in Spanish-speaking countries through the Spanish department and the McCulloch Center, and I found one that was Partners in Health's program um, in Peru, so Socios en Salud. Once I got to um, Socios en Salud, I realized that my skills as an EMT were really going to be useful for the programming that they do with some of their community health workers. I set up a, a series of workshops that we did. We did six workshops, and um, each one focused on a different set of skills that really pertain to what they were doing in their communities. So for instance, we did vital signs one, one day, and then we went on to burns, and we went on to mobilizing patients, and then we put a lot of focus in how to take advantage of the resources in their communities by connecting with their local fire department and connecting with one another so that it was more of a cohesive emergency action plan. I'm very excited this, um, that this summer I will now um, be going back to Peru to work with the community health promoters again uh, since I was granted the Davis Projects for Peace Fellowship. And I'm really excited to be collaborating with another EMT from Mount Holyoke and the two of us will be able to expand upon the first aid course programming that I developed last summer and offer it to two groups of promotoras in, um, in the Lima area, in San Juan de Urigancho and also 